new at six. It's not every day you see cars sinking <laughs> off of South Beach, but today it's all part of a bold new plan to protect our coastline. 911, what's your emergency? Uh -oh. There's a car in the ocean. <laughs> the reef line project is turning concrete into coral, launching an underwater art reef that's as surreal as it sustainable. CBS News Miami's Lisa Petrillo has our story. The reef line project is breathing new life into South Florida's coastal waters, blending environmental science with artistic expression. Why can't we stop now that we're in one of the biggest climate tipping points that we know that if we don't do something now, you know, in 100 years the reef will be gone. Over the next 22 weeks, 22 life-size concrete cars will be submerged 780 feet offshore, creating a surreal underwater traffic jam. The installation, titled Concrete Coral, features vehicles molded in Homestead and embedded with over 2,000 native corals using cutting-edge marine technology. Scientists from ReefLine are collaborating with the University of Miami's Rescue a Reef program to ensure the corals thrive. Miami has some of the most resilient and I think some of the most scientifically valuable corals on the planet and we can learn so much from how corals are able to adapt right here in the city that I think it really puts Miami at the forefront of global coral science. Supported by the city of Miami Beach and approved by local voters, ReefLine is gaining momentum with a wave of public and private donations with a goal to raise $40 million and stretch the reef corridor across seven miles. This is just phase one. It's going to transform uh, the environment, the ecology, and that's why it's uh, a project that um, it will change the lives of the people here and more of the ocean. This is going to be an amazing addition for those who want to explore even more on the beach. For ReefLine co-founder Jimena Caminos, the mission is rooted in hope and inspiration. I'd love people also to see ReefLine as a symbol for hope, for collaboration, a symbol for education, science, tech, and but basically a symbol of human ingenuity and how we, when we come together we can tackle anything. And while today marks the first official splash of the reef line, organizers say it will take up to 10 years for the full completion of the seven mile corridor right here on Miami Beach. Ready to jump in everybody? I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS News, Miami.